Governor Lamb came out strong tonight, taking an early lead. That energized his supporters at his quarters in Cecil Township. Yeah, things have certainly tightened up since the early hours. Kim Gable is live, and she joins us now with more. Kim. Yeah, Ken, you know, definitely things are changing, literally, not only by the minute, but by the second here. Um, just 20 seconds ago, I had to turn around and see what was happening. So we are hearing right now, as you hear the crowd here cheering behind me, uh, that those absentee ballots that are so crucial in this particular election, we are hearing tonight, and again, this is unofficial, but we are hearing tonight that those uh, look to be right now in the favor of Democrat Connor Lamb. So hundreds of people packed in here to the uh, Hilton South Point. We're in the ballroom, shoulder to shoulder. I heard Ralph there say no one has left the ballroom where he is. I mean, that's that's the case here as well, as people are just glued to these big screens behind me, watching these results come in. Again, shoulder to shoulder, a lot of the journalists here, a lot of the supporters saying they've never really seen uh, anything quite like this, so close, so late in the game. But keep in mind, uh, those few thousand absentee ballots that are being counted right now could be the deciding factor. So. What else is the deciding factor here tonight? I talked to the chairman of the Democratic Party uh, here in Pennsylvania a short time ago. He said that really aggressive push to get those registered Democrats out to the polls today, he said that worked. He also said uh, the issue of galvanizing the organized uh, labor, galvanizing the workforce here in the 18th Congressional District. That was a factor as well. So literally, things here changing by the moment. I'm having to turn around here and see what folks are talking about. I'm getting information in my ear, getting information on my computer. Um, a neck and neck race here. We're going to let you know what happens. Connor Lamb also in this hotel. Uh, he is anxiously watching those results come in as well. We're going to come back here live as soon as we have a decision.